Japan is clearing up the damage after a powerful earthquake. The 7.4 magnitude quake, which struck late last night off the coast of Fukushima, has killed at least three people, and more than 190 have been injured across 12 prefectures. Power is being gradually restored for millions of homes, and several thousands are still without water. Residents were jolted awake as the quake struck just after 11.30 p.m. local time. Buildings rattled, throwing items off shelves. The tremors lasted more than two minutes. Shocks were felt 240 kilometers away in the capital. Street lamps were seen swaying in central Tokyo. More than two million households were plunged into darkness. The Sendai and Iwaki airports left without power. A tsunami warning was briefly issued. Waves of up to 30 centimeters were reported at Ishinomaki port in Miyagi prefecture. Hundreds of people living along the coasts of Fukushima and Miyagi were evacuated to shelters. The extent of the damage became clearer as dawn broke. Parts of buildings tumbled into streets, highways and roads with large gaping cracks. The quake derailed a bullet train near Fukushima. More than 70 people were trapped for hours, but later escaped via an emergency exit. Multiple aftershocks were felt across the region this morning. The quake hit off the coast of Japan's eastern Fukushima prefecture. That's the same region devastated by a powerful quake and tsunami 11 years ago, resulting in a nuclear power plant meltdown. 福島第一原発、福島第二原発及び女川原発は現時点でプラントのデータに異常はないとの報告を受けております。Thousands of households still had no power or water as authorities rushed to restore services. The government said electricity and water supplies should resume by the end of the day. 当時は今より今というかその昨夜の方のが揺れが強かったんで、まああのそこまでにならなければいいなっていうなんていうんですかね、ちょっとこう淡い期待みたいなものがありました。はい。ちょうど十二ちょっと前に地震のあれで驚い